So I've gotten a lot of questions on how I take my black seed oil. So I wanted to shoot a quick video um, on this since I'm getting ready to take some anyway. So I basically just pour it out of the bottle into a teaspoon. Um, I have my juice handy because I cannot stand the taste. Um, so basically, I just pour the oil, give myself a full teaspoon. And immediately take some pineapple or apple juice. And so each time I pour, there's always some that just sort of drips. I take this and I use it. <laughs> I do not let any of this go to waste at all. Um, I rub it all over my face. It's good for your skin. It's a good moisturizer. And I just let that sit while I am getting ready for the day. Now, another way that I use it is with my shea butter. This is African shea butter, 100% pure. And I take some of this, and this is my container where I mix it. So I take a spoon, take some of this, And I just put it into the bowl. And then I pour in some black seed oil. Now it just really depends on how much uh, butter I use in here at one time. Right now I'm just putting a tab in here just to give you guys an idea of how I do this. So I'm just going to mix in maybe half of a teaspoon. Okay, again, I use that excess oil that has spilled over to the sides. And so I mix this really, really good. This can be used on your hair. This can be used on your body. As soon as I get out of the shower, I have enough of this. Um, as soon as I get out of the shower, I'll, I'll um, rub this on. But I have enough of this mixed together and placed in a airtight container. So I'll basically just use this for when I get out of the shower. Um, it becomes a nice paste, smooth paste. Um, I use this when I get out of the shower. I use this on my hair. You know, whatever you want to use it for, you can. Um, so that's that. And then I um, actually also use some neem oil. I put a few drops in there. If I'm using this for my skin, um, again, I have very dry skin. Neem oil is very good for that. Um, I'm not, I usually get, I tend to get like dry skin in my eyebrows right around here. And neem oil is very, very good for that. I'll do a video one day on neem oil. Um, and the benefits of this. This has a lot of amazing um, benefits, including natural birth control. Um, yes, yeah, so anyway, I'll make a video on that one day. But yeah, I wanted to show you guys how I use this. Um, sometimes I will pour the neem or I'm sorry. The black seed oil directly into my hair and I will just let it sit right before I condition it um, I will put it on my scalp directly onto my scalp after I blow dried it or before I blow dry it um, and onto my ends so that's another way you can use it I won't show you that now my hair is in a bun but yep that is how I use this black seed oil uh, if you want to see quicker benefits um, with using it internally, I suggest taking a teaspoon in the morning and a teaspoon at night. 
two times a day for um, a while and see how that works for you. Um, I don't like to take things to the extreme when I first uh, get them, so get products. I like to sort of take my time and just see how it naturally um, adapts with my body. So I initially started with a teaspoon of black seed oil, one a day, and I've continued that. So just a few examples of how I use this black seed oil. Um, I decided to make this video because people were asking how I use it, how much I use, etc. If you have any comments, just leave them below. Please thumbs up and please subscribe. I will be working on a video tonight that should be out tomorrow. I know I said 12 11, but it'll be out tomorrow 12 12 by in the morning. Um it's on these peace candles. Can't wait to tell you guys about this and yeah, that's it. Uh have a good day. Bye forgot to mention that I do use the black seed oil in my mouth after I brush my teeth. I do swish it around in my mouth for maybe like 30 seconds to a minute um, after I brush my teeth and then I rinse with warm water. I figured it only benefit if anything, you know, so I don't know. I'll keep you updated on that as well. Thanks. Bye.